All right, what's up, guys? It's Light Hyper here with another video on SW Bros. And today's video is going to be a Dragons B10 team with Breon of the Wind Death Knight. So, first, I'll tell you all what all each of the monsters does and how you could replace one of them in case you don't have them. I'll show you my runes at the end of the run, and just right off the bat, I'm gonna tell you guys that this is like a five-six minute run. It's a really slow run. But that's just how it's going to work if you're using a reviver because usually with a reviver you're going to go right crystal first and then boss. Sorry if it's a little bit, yeah, it's a little bit laggy right now. Sorry about that. But um, anyways, so yeah, so let's get started. So Verd, Verdahill, the fire vampire, is unfortunately very hard to replace. For those who don't have him, it's unfortunate. But, I mean, you could try Bernard or any attack bar buffer would maybe work because you see what what Verd does is every time he crits he gives each one of your teammates twenty percent more attack bar so and you I have mine on of course hundred crit rate I think or close to it. Um so basically every time he crits and then he gives them all my teammates, you know, twenty percent. So each he attacks two times on the first skill, so that's uh that's forty percent attack bar. So yeah, this is really laggy. Hopefully that's all right with you guys. Sorry about that. But so Verd to replace, you could use uh, Bernard or Pyrian maybe or Meg Megan maybe would work. Uh, any attack bar buffer is best. All right, and then Breon is of course just the revive. Oh, and I forgot to say Verd also has the speed lead, which is very nice. Twenty eight to twenty four percent speed lead in dungeons. So I think it's twenty eight. So that's really good. That's hard to find another one of those. I think he might be the only one, actually. I don't know, but he that's really good. And then Breond is the reviver of the team. So if you don't have Breond, then just... Well, this video is mainly a Breon kind of spotlight video. But if you don't have Breon, then any reviver would work. So Mykeen or Iona, if you're lucky enough to have one. And then Bella is basically the healer and the death breaker. So... If you don't have Bella, you should definitely get one, but if you don't, you could use, like, Galleon for the Death Break, maybe, if you want to move into more of a speed team, Galleon would work, and then if you don't, then just go ahead and use, like, Emma or Chasun, and your run will be even slower, probably, but, I mean, whatever, it's alright if you can, if you, you know, still win. So, as you can see, we're going right tower first. To get th so that he doesn't have immunity, since we're not we our only stripper is Bella, and when you kill the right crystal, it it like kills one of your guys, whoever did the last damage to the crystal, it kills. If you do if the dots kill him, then that's even better because it doesn't do any, it doesn't kill anyone. But other that's why we have Breon though to just revive the. That's why we have Breon to revive whoever it counterattacks and kills, so. Uh, oh yeah, so where was it? So Hua is just mainly the main nuker kind of the team, and it also pushes the attack bar back. So if you don't have Hua, you could use Spectra, or you could, if you want to move into more speed team, you could use a nuker like Theo Mars or Sig, Sigmaris or something like that. Uh, what? And she does the dots too, which is nice for killing these bosses and stuff. And then, all right. See, it just counteracted Verd, but we have Breon to revive him right there. And then Bella to heal. So, Vero is the cleanser of the team. So, if you don't have Vero, the best replacement is Kona, probably, or any cleanser you have would work. Vero is really good, though. But, if, yeah, if you don't have Vero, then go ahead and use another cleanser would work. So, yeah, this is a pretty slow run. I'll show you the runes after this. It would be nice if these guys would do some dots, but... <laughs> We'll see. Um, there we go. All right. So yeah, this is about five, six minutes. It's pretty slow. So where was I? Oh yeah, I already said Vero. So Vero, yeah, Kona, I guess. Or if you have um, like you know, a good Nat Five. Like if you have Vela Jewel or something like that, Vela Jewel would also work very well. Oh, someone just got an Argon <laughs> Rip. Anyways, uh, where were we? There's five dots, so that's 25% health. All right, so this next turn he should be dead. 
when he gets his next turn, he'll die. Or maybe before that, we'll even kill him, maybe. Probably. Because Hua's pushing the attack bar back. Alright, let's see how slow. Let's see the time of this run. Alright. 454, so yeah, about 5 minutes. Uh, I mean, that's. It's good for a starter GB, DB10 team. Alright, so now I'll go ahead and show you my runes. So, Verd, there's his runes. Yep, 100 crit rate. And if you need to pause it to look at them, then go ahead. See, I haven't even really upgraded these. I need to get around to upgrading these. And my team right here, also, none of them are at the max accuracy cap for dragons, which is 55% accuracy. So, if that's even showing that you could beat this even without that. So, if you have it, you'll definitely should beat it. There's Hua. I need way more speed on my Hua. Wow, I didn't... See, I haven't even upgraded that. It's plus zero. I need to upgrade these runes, but it's almost rune removal is why I haven't. I'm just going to re-rune everyone. And then we got Vero. Vero, there's his stats. So, yeah, I need to re-rune these people. Uh, all right, who else was there? Bella. Bella's on violent as well. But yeah, like I said, so if you get 55 accuracy on all your people then that'll be even better because the debuffs will always land more consistently than what mine are. We're landing in that because I only have 45% accurate. I have less than 55 on every single one of them. So here's Breon, speed, HP, accuracy. All right, and then there's the stats right there. All right, guys, that's going to be basically it. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys later.